My name is Anihira, uh, I'm a bus driver. I've been with National Express since 2001. Initially, when I started, uh, it was Travel West Midlands, but then afterwards, um, they rebranded it to National Express. To start off with, uh, I was on a full-time contract, uh, but due to family commitments, I've had to reduce my hours to a part-time contract um, to three days a week. No, go to Bye. You're gonna go now. Oh, you, 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 you. <laughs> 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 yeah, good boy. My day-to-day -day, um, duties do vary. Uh, they vary from uh, early shifts, split shifts, um, which start at um, the garage and then I have middays and lates which start at the bus station and finish at the garage. For example, if I was given an early duty, I would uh, book on a park lane garage. This is where all the buses are kept um, overnight and cleaned. We've been given 15 minutes to complete a VCR, which is a vehicle condition report, um, to check the buses over for any defects um, so that um, it's fit for service. A VCR is a visual check inside and outside the bus uh, for any sharp edges or loose panels. Inside the bus, we'd be checking the horn the windscreen wipers, the windscreen washers, the stop buzzers, the emergency exits and the seats. Outside we'll visually be checking for uh, the tyres, the windscreen wipers, the wiper blades, the lights, the signals um, and the emergency exits. However, if I was given a midday or a late, um, we're still given 15 minutes uh, book on time, but I'll just take over at the bus station. Every so often, National Express recruit new drivers. Once they become a fully qualified driver, they start their route training. Once they've completed that, they're paired up with various different drivers um, on a day-to-day -day basis, where we can guide them um, and teach them a bit more about the routes.
as a professional driver we have to deal with many situations that may arise from one of my personal experiences uh, when I was on the 126 a couple of months back uh, I picked up a number of school kids uh, on my journey back to Wolverhampton uh, from Parkfield Road um, one of the kids actually jumped out from the top deck of the bus luckily he didn't injure himself but when I found out about this has happened I had to report it back to the inspectors first uh, then we reported it to the police uh, which then the police dealt with the matter um, I gave them a full statement as to what exactly happened uh, the police went down to the school dealt with the matter and now we don't have that issue anymore now uh, National Express have heavily invested into new hybrid buses to go eco-friendly overall I enjoy meeting new people I enjoy driving and I'm proud to be part of the National Express team.